Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's video we're playing Time Princess and checking out the latest story called Magpie Tower. I'm very excited for this one. The outfit that I've seen teased looks really good and I'm very excited. Also today we're going to be doing the pulls for the carnival feast because today's the last day so stay tuned if you want to see that until the end of the video but for now let's go straight into checking out our story. So, Magpie Tower is a three chapter story, which has been a minute since we had one of those. No? Santigo was a lot, but this one is three chapters. Then, with difficulty, is the average three butterfly. It is 356 MB to download if you want to know that. And it costs 70 tickets, which I think is average. And these are the warnings alcohol consumption, blah, blah, blah. As per usual, let's start off by checking out our eight set for this story. That's not much for three chapters, is it? Well, let's get into our first outfit, which is Magpie and Kai. Also, excuse my character's face i changed her once again i wanted to have smaller eyes to look more like my life makeover character because i saw someone on instagram do it and it looked really nice but my character just looks weird i can't make her look right i don't know what it is the outfit however i love this it's a two-piece there's like buckles it's like double layer skirt we got going on i love the hair it has like all these braids and then into little buns with the blue it looks gorgeous and this is probably even going to be like the free outfit i'm just going to say this straight up is a five out of five i'm feeling optimistic today i'm feeling positive i really like this plushy cute oh but the plushy of course is a lucky jerry item of course i forgot they do that now next up corner chicken store which is also a pretty cute outfit this is not the first like chef outfit we've had <laughs> perfect storm but i like this one way better so she's supposed to be like a kfc worker i guess i think my favorite part is here are her little chicken sneakers she has little fried drumsticks on there and i just love the casual look the skirt is attached to the jeans which is kind of unfortunate because i would like some more jeans but the top itself is also kind of cute. She has one oven mitt on. Also her hair, I don't know how I feel about it. It's fairly early 2000s, right? To have that really bold contrast in highlight. But I do think the front is kind of cute. <gasps> oh, do you see her earrings? So on one side we have a little fork and then on the other side we have a little fried egg. That's really cute. Yeah, this is really nice. I wouldn't say I would dress up with this because what are you going to make with this? But I'm going to give this three and a half. Let's do three and a half. Nah, th this, this is what I wanted. I said last time I want more like these outfits in the stories this is exactly what i'm talking about so this is dedicated delivery this is another casual outfit look at that jacket look at the little sheep on it he's so sleepy and we have a really cute necklace this is like oh look at the beret now nah, this is also completely what i wanted and here are the casual jeans that we've been asking for and another pair of all stars with a little sheep detail and we have some striped socks that are really cute the hair i don't like this much but if i do this with like the hairs that i like oh my gosh it's gonna look so cute I hope the jacket is compatible with skirts. This, all these outfits are great. I'm going to say this is a four out of five. If it was like red or pink, I would have lost it. But this is really, really good. Back to, oh, so great. You're going to lose me here. This is dancing cocoa beans. This is a five out of five straight up. Come on. This is some shit I would wear outside. This is what I wear on a daily basis. This is so cute. She has a little frappe with a cat on it. She has the cutest little necklace. Her jacket is like leather and it has like a little keychain. And she's wearing puffy sleeves with little rims everywhere. Oh my god. And then her skirt is pleated, but she's like double layer and she has a lot of those skirt chains. So cute. She's wearing boots with the socks. Perfect. Oh my gosh. I love this. Her hair is really nice to berate. This is a five out of five. This is really, really good. Wow. Outfit number five is a flower and youth guy. This is really, really cute. This is one of the cutest dresses I've seen in a while. What can I say? This is like all the frillies, the bows, the pleated pattern. We have a little lace trim underneath. There's so many ruffles. Dude, you have to get this story just for the outfits alone. I don't know what it's going to be like. I don't even care at this point. This is amazing. I love this dress. I can't wait to dress up with this. Then we have a cute headband. And on her face, we have some flowery details here as well as some flower clear earrings, which are really cute as well. Her shoes, I like a little bit less, but she has little cats on her socks. So that's really cute. This is going to be a four out of five, but that's mainly because I love the dress. The rest is a little bit simple, but oh my gosh. Everything is heart shaped too. Look, the bag is like cats with hearts and then the thingies wear with hearts and then the necklaces with hearts i love that outfit number six is false fairy tale uh, i don't know about this one this is not my style but i can 
see the vibe. So I don't really like the hair with the highlight. I don't think blue would be the color here for me. I would have chosen a warmer color, like the green we saw earlier with the jacket. I really like these boots. These are perfect for like some casual outfit you want to make. They are really high as well. And then the outfit itself is like a long coat, raincoat with a turtleneck and a cute skirt. Her back is okay. I just, I don't know. I don't, I'm not vibing with the blue here. I don't really like it that much, but the hat. Another beret, I can appreciate it. We need more like casual hats anyway. This is great. I'm going to give this a three out of five. And this is blueberry ice cream, which they teased on Facebook, which I was really excited to see. Cause have you, have you, have you seen it? <laughs> I would, I want it. This is the Lucky Jerry set, most of it. So we're gonna try and pull for this. We have some blueberry ice cream shoes and the socks. The outfit itself is also a two piece. So we have a skirt with another chain on it. And then the top, it's very dressed up for this one, but I love it. And the hair bow, no, we gotta have everything. I'm gonna spend tickets today. <laughs> I'm gonna spend tickets. This is, I'm not gonna say five, but I'm gonna say four, four and a half, four. So something like that. Oh my God, I need the bag. And our last outfit is Nocturnal Traveler. And this is 100% my boyfriend's style. He would love him to see me in something like this, but this is not my aesthetic, but it is very well made. I can appreciate the art of it and especially all the straps and stuff. Normally it's really hard for me to like it because it sometimes just looks off. Like this one here looks a bit weird, but all the other straps and stuff feel like they belong where they are. So I can appreciate that. A lot of detail here. So we have like a little chain down here. Also the shoes. Oh, these shoes are also a Lucky Jerry item. So we're gonna have to pull for that because I love me some black super tight high boots. The hair, the glasses and the hair is definitely a no-go for me. This is definitely like the weakest outfit for me. Nonetheless, is this is still a good outfit, but most of this is also Lucky Jerry. So hopefully we won't get off this too much, but I'm gonna give this like, I'm gonna be still generous here. I'm gonna give this say a three out of five. This is still pretty good. Now let's go to the store and see all the blueprints you can buy. There are no blueprints. That's crazy. That's the first time ever, I think, that there are no blueprints. Prints. Wow, I don't know what to say. Then these are the six items available for purchase. I'm gonna do that real quick and then let's move on to... Let's do companions first, you know? Let's do companions before Lucky Jerry. So we have three companions and this is Lee ha Yoon. I think it's gonna be a Korean story in again. This guy, I don't know, he's nice. He looks different from like the typical guy because sometimes the, in TP the guys kind of look the same. And I love his outfit. It very much matches the outfit we just had to look at and the Burberry print in the back and then his little belt keeping his shirt up like he looks he looks nice i like it next up we have song Gyun. i hope i said that right and she looks also nice she looks very classy i like her outfit the character models do, do look a little bit different i appreciate that and then lastly we have kim Seon woo he's very much fanboy definitely i don't know if i like his outfit it's a little bit too messy with the boat here right but maybe he's nice who knows <laughs> did you hear that that's voice lines <laughs> Oh, I can't wait to hear that in the story. And okay, this is what he sounds like. Okay, girl. Well, I'm already such a big fan of this story. Let's go to a Lucky Jerry. Since the sprint is over, I only have seven only 700 tickets so i'm thinking i want to do 300 because i do really love this everything so let's start with 200 and see how much we have in the end and then maybe we'll do 300 but let's start with our first 100 ah i'm so excited i really hope we can get some good stuff from the pink set so starting off strong starting off so strong we have the little cat drink oh my god i love me good handheld that's real we have the boost can't really miss me with anything except for like the last outfit. Like I said, they had a lot of Lucky Jerry eyes. So maybe get some rings or something, but. <laughs> <laughs> all right we have that this is from the last set that's okay i really like the song i didn't know the garter was like attached to it we have the hair for it as well next up we have maybe we get the relic too we have the glasses i think i jinxed myself we only get like three things from that set next up we have the top all right, I jinxed it. The microphone heard me talk about it and TP was like, all right, let's give her all of that. And we have our first relic, which is only a three star enchanted music box. And we have the shoes. That's a five star. Hell yeah. Oh my God. I love pulling for new stories because the duplicates are so little, you know? All right. And then lastly, nothing new. Oh, we had our first duplicate. We have the ring. That is really cute. Don't like rings, but that one is kind of cute. And that is our first 100. Let's keep it going. We have the bag for the blue outfit, I want to say. Let's give me something in a dress. <laughs> Oh, we have it. Oh, it's so, it's so cute. 
I cannot tell me that this is not the cutest item in the I love a little stupid cat face. We have another enchanting music box. I'm a big fan. A third one, because why not? Oh, I guess it's a three star probably. We have the hair for the blueberry outfit, which is a six star, which is really nice. Oh, we're definitely going to do another 100 pulls here. We have all purpose cleaner, which is our second relic and another music box. Dude, I don't need that many. <laughs> And then we have another one of the kitty bag and another- Come on, I, I said I don't like the guy. <laughs> I said he was not that cute. We have the bracelets for the blueberry outfit. All right, next up we have- What's that? It says glasses, but I think it's like- for the cheek, maybe? Uh, we have another duplicate glasses. Then we have another duplicate glasses. Come on. We have another all-purpose clean. At least it's a four star, but I don't know if the last guy is five stars. All right, let's do another 100 because new girl wants to duplicate. This is what I saw rolling in. We have the necklace. I don't know if there's any tops or dresses still available to pull for. We have another music box. Come on. That is... <laughs> too much we have a choker basic but cute we're gonna make an outfit in the end i'm gonna make it look nice i'm sorry if this video is gonna be really long i have a lot to do in this video we have another one of the dress we have that's earrings with piercings on it that's pretty cool another music book yeah, seven i haven't even level up the guy so i'm gonna get like another 10 relics on that that's great i'm being haunted come on leave me alone we have the beret, really cute. We have the choker again. I think this is the last 10. We have the bracelet, hmm. All right, we're gonna stop here because that's too much of that. Got some new shoes out of the box as well. Anyone wondering what the tags are? This is warm and grand and he is simple elegant. I didn't pull for the third guy, so I couldn't tell you, I'm sorry. But I could almost awaken him already, even, even if I would get him to level 50, but I don't know if I'm gonna do that. <laughs> That is ridiculous. Yeah, I'm gonna start reading now, but by the I don't know what it's gonna be about, but from the looks of it, it's gonna be like a modern Korean story, which I do really like. I really like the Siwoo story. I'm just gonna go read and then we'll see what comes out of it. I just finished the first two levels and I love it. I don't have no idea where this is gonna go because there's not really, there's only like a setup for like all the characters to get to know each other, but there is not a, a continuation yet, only like characters. So let's make an outfit while I explain what, what the story's about. We are the main character, which is, I can't pronounce that, Yoon Ha Yoon, and it's a girl who has like extreme super strength. So she's like really good at everything. And now she's an adult and she works in a chicken shop that used to be her parents and she runs basically the whole business. And then the first companion we got introduced to is the first guy that we saw, which is Lee Ha Young, and the main character already like, oh my god, he's so cute. He looks like a gigabyte character, so she's already like into him, right? And he's there to apply for a job, and she's all excited about it because she's been looking for someone, but she can't really pay out that much because, of course, she's not that rich. So the next day, when they're opened, he comes to work there, and then our second main character, the girl, shows up, the Ga Yoon, and she's a regular customer, but she seems to have some sort of OCD, so she always sits in the same spot and she sanitizes everything like she's super strict about her hygiene and then our third companion shows up who turned out to be a ballet dancer which is Kim Shun Hu and he's a ballet dancer and he ends up sharing the table with them and you kind of see like the chemistry between everyone mostly what I notice is that this character is actually likable like I like this main character because it's very intense on moral justice like in the first level she fights away a bully in front of her store because she says like what if you got bullied you know and then later she's at the market and this lady stutters and then the, the fish guy gets annoyed at her so she stands up for her as well and also our first companion ha, Lee Han Yoon he has a silver allergy so she orders stainless steel silverware just so he can work there and like touch the silverware which is like really nice and it's a rare that the main character is actually like I like the main character right I also have like a sense of really high moral justice so I, I like that she does that as well also very nice there is a a lot of voice acting already so when the art card shows up sometimes you have those art cards that like move a little bit there was like full voice acting it was all in korean though but it did help with immersion a lot so if you can understand korean good for you but like other than that it's just like so you sound know what the characters sound like which was really nice i like that a lot and i don't know where the story is going to go i think it's going to have something to do with her superpowers and maybe all the other characters also have like a secret superpower and they come together to do something i don't know but so far i feel like this is like my favorite story of the whole year i think i can confidently say 
motivated. Look at this outfit. This is with like the free stuff that we got basically. Look how cute this is. This is saving that one. We're saving on that one. So overall, I would say get this one. I don't even think it should be a debate. If you love casual outfits, it's especially a plus. The story is very like K-drama because in K-dramas, they also, all, the ones I've seen, basically all of them always own a fried chicken shop. So I was probably gonna go somewhere in that route. I don't know, but so far, love it now this was my review for the magpie tower story so i'm now going to move on to our panda pool video event thing so here we are at the carnival feast i normally don't really like these events because they're really hard to pull for but i've seen other people pull for it and they had like insane luck so let's hope that we also have that much luck i can still buy a few boxes if i have to like we can get a little bit more but yeah, this is 120 if I were to buy all of that, but I don't know if I want to do that. So in the first one, we have the hair, the socks, and the shoes. Then we have, what is this? Oh, that's a little pen on the head. I really, really want that. But the pool chance for it is, look how high, 15%. That's really high. This one as well. Like there's almost a better chance to pull for these than you get the boxes, which thank you TP for once for changing the rates. Normally this was like 3%, right? Same as for these. I don't know. This is the, oh, it's the handheld. I don't really need these as much. I don't think I'm going to be doing the pulls for this one because i don't really like these so let's skip on set three i think and then four the dress is three percent but i've seen people pull for everything so i think i want to go for the dress first because i mean look at it <laughs> look at it look at the bag I, the, the bow nah and of course the rest the background piece and everything comes if you open everything which we will not be doing today so i think i'm going to start off with this one for the dress now let's try for this one first because these ones are cheaper all right we have the tickets yes See, Se second pool, and we got the one I want. Oh my God, this is so good. Look, that, that was like a 50%, these are way higher. Okay, okay, let, let's go on with, oh, the hair is also kind of cute though. All right, these are also cheap. Let's do the other ones last. 600, we need for everything. So I might buy some extra tickets after all. Let's see if we can get the hair or something. Okay, girl. Do I want to keep going? We can do two more. Actually, let's do these first. All right, all right, all right. Let's see if we can get the dress. Okay, we got nothing. And we have the dress. <laughs> what? Shut up. What is this? This is a rings. I don't need that though. Okay, I guess we're going to keep going for the sock. That's crazy. No, nah, if they change the, the rates for this... There we have the shoes. So cute. If they're gonna keep changing the race like this for just like permanently, I'm gonna like this event. I'm not gonna lie. Let's see if we can get the socks here. And there we have the sock. I didn't even have to open the other ones. This has never happened before that I got everything that I wanted. I don't know. I th guess we're gonna go for the handheld or the gloves. Also, these are pretty cheap. So we have the necklace. Okay, then we have nothing. We have... <gasps> Now nah, there's gotta be something. We have the gloves. All right, I have, I say enough for one more. And it's not the handheld. You know what, let's buy it. I have a lot of diamonds right now. No, I have 95. They know what they're doing. I have to wait. They, they I bet they calculated that. Well, now I have 125, so it better be in here. <laughs> all right now i don't have to spend anymore i have 25 left but i can't use that on anything so maybe no because if i buy the last one i am gonna have 55 so i'm gonna be five short so i can't do the last pool that's a bit of a waste but that's okay so we gotta have love that all right so this was my magpie tower review as well as my carnival feels pools i am loving the story so far i can't wait to read it more and i'm sorry if it's, it's if i don't if the story is gonna take a big turn and we don't know what it's gonna be but i have no idea what it's gonna be like but so far i love it let me know down below what you think of the new story because i, I want to know if you're just excited as i am and thank you all so much for watching i hope you have a great day and i'll see you in the next video bye